This is Nashville yes. hot chicken chili. I'm gonna use this um, hot chicken oil as a base. It has a lot of cayenne in it. Don't panic. How are you doing over there? I'm good. Yeah, doing I'm, a good job. I'm excited to learn all of your your hot tips. Do you get it? Hot tips. Hot I did. That's so good. You must be a songwriter. No, I feel like when I'm home now and off the road, I actually like to be home, and I want to get better at like finding things that I can do at home that feel creative. I love to go out to a restaurant and eat. Mm. I love it. But you've done that for uh, half, three weeks on the road yes. and you just want to be home in your pajamas. And it's nice. And this is basically making your own hot chili oil. I put in two tablespoons of brown sugar, a teaspoon of paprika, a teaspoon of garlic powder, and a teaspoon of salt. I'm just going to whisk that all together. All right. You are good. I'm going to use about a quarter cup of this hot oil. And we're going to save the rest. It's spicy. It's looking spicy. And then you can just go in. Just right on in? Yep. OK. Beautiful. We can mix them together. That's yeah. all right. I'm going to boss you around and ask you to grab some chicken, because we can't have chicken I got without, you. Can't I can do chicken this. chicken without chicken. There's a couple of packages of ground chicken in the fridge. OK. I'm just going to put this chicken right in. Yeah. So my mom would do, like, turkey-based chili. Yeah. And her secret trick, which I still don't know what it did, but she would put beer in it. She secretly probably was drinking a beer yeah, while she was Yeah, she probably had it. the rest of it and just put the last one in. Yeah. So I've got some white. Cannellini beans back here that I have yes, drained. Yes, Do you mind grabbing those? Mm hmm It's mm. two cans of Drinks. white cannellini beans. You can use whatever you like. I just thought because this is sort of a light colored chili, it'd be really pretty to put these in here. And they're cream, kind of creamy. Some tomatoes. I got a can of tomatoes okay. there. Yep. Yeah, smelling just good. Right into the. Yeah, it is smelling really good. And then, how do you feel about adding a little hot sauce? Line trust. Okay. I do. Well, oh, that's good. Ooh, I smell that. <laughs> And then we're going to add in some chicken stock. So you can just kind of eyeball. OK. When Love you're making it. savory stuff, too, you don't have to. Um, a little more. A little more. A little more. <laughs> That's it. That's good. <laughs> now, I'm going to let this simmer just a little bit. Ready to try this mm -hmm. chili? It's sizzling. It's going to change your life. So we're going to put some chili in. I'm going to ask you to dollop a little bit of sour cream in the middle. And then I've chopped up some bread and butter pickles. If you've never had pickles mm. and chili, you're going to love it. I haven't, actually, but I love pickles. And then hand it back to me, and I'm going to drizzle a little more of this hot oil on the top. OK. Just for another nod. Trade ya. Thank you. That's lovely. OK. I'm just going to take a little bit of this oil. Just a little more. All right, and then we're going to have a seat. I'll give you a little plate. Oh, yeah, thank you. All right, moment of truth. That's right. You try it first. I'm nervous. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm nervous yeah, that my mouth's going to be on fire. Mmm. <laughs> it is hot. And spicy <laughs> and hot. Those pickles add a lot, don't they? Mm hmm. It's really spicy. If you're okay, you can have a drink. <laughs> 